Tonight, this home right here, built by a group of high schoolers, all as a part of Erie County's BOCES Building Trades program. And once the finishing touches are put on, the keys will go to the highest bidder. It took a group of juniors and seniors a full year to build that home. 1,300 square feet, three bedrooms, one bathroom. The BOCES course has been running this project for decades. The class uses the money then raised by the previous home auction to fund the materials for next year. 7 News reporter Ryan Arbogast takes us on a tour as the course instructor wraps up his final home before retirement. This 1,300 square foot, three bedroom, one bath, sitting in the Erie One BOCES parking lot in Cheektowaga is not your typical house. We're in the student uh, building business. We're not in the home building business. Each year, high school students in the BOCES Building Trades program build a house as part of their final project. So a, a hands-on program like this is what a lot of the students need. After a year of hard work, they auction the home off and host an open house to make back the cost so they can do it again next year. A lot of the kids like to work with their hands. There's so much satisfaction in um, stepping back and looking at what you've done that day. Chris Bergio has been the building trades teacher for the last 20 years, and this house is his last hurrah. He's retiring on Friday, but hopes this program continues. And I can see it in these, these young people's eyes when they do it, and they, they uh, uh, actually can succeed at something. And you can see the light bulb going off and the smile and how proud they are that they built something like that. That something is not just an arts and crafts project. It was built to be like any other home on the market. It's, it's good quality. I oversee every, every uh, piece of material that went into the house. And it is a good quality house. The house is available via auction online until Sunday evening. You can check it out by scanning the QR code on your screen right now. Ryan Arbogast. 7 News Cheek to Wagga.